Hey, hey, Jelly Toast, you're back with more Residents of Fate. I did more grindy stuff, <clears throat> and then I found a doll in an extra mission, so... What now? I am willing to part with it. But thank you, I'm sure my granddaughter will love it. This is for you, please take it. Flame resistant vest. Nice. If you find any more dolls out there in your travels, I'll happily take them off your hands. Don't worry, I'll make them worth your while. Sorry I cleared my throat a little earlier. It probably did not sound nice on the recording. Check! And now there's a bridal doll next to the clown. Her lips are ugly though. <coughs> um, are there any we use things I could any ammunition buy you could imagine. I could buy this handgun right now, but I want to make sure I have at least a little money left over in case of customization. Uh, have a nice day. So I won't get it yet. Okay, so since I finished uh, grinding uh, for hexes in the arena, went up in rank. Oh yeah, I changed Leanne's headband because I found her current maid cap in a hex. And I was like, why not? It's super cute. The base. Let's move on to the next chapter. Come on, come on. What would like advance? Advance to the next chapter? Yes. Chapter four and Bling! trophy popped up. Would you like to save your progress? Yeah, sure. I'll save it here just in case I might have missed anything, but I don't think I did. Oh no, wait, then I should have saved the other one. Oh man. Oh well, too late now. Yes, I understand. Of course. We're on our way. Who's calling us now? Huh. Well, that came out of nowhere. Must be big. Where to? Why does he have a Chandelier. collar on his neck? Cardinal Barbarella awaits. Is it Barbarella already? And how come only Leanne has, like, home clothes, but Vacheron and Zephyr wear... Their outdoor clo clothes all the time. It must get uncomfortable. Ooh, red hexes and purple hexes. And yet again, Pater's here. <laughs> Miss Leanne. Z Z Zephyr. Her, her. Ahyuk. I'll be back. What's that? What the heck? Did he want to talk with Zephyr? Why did he say Zephyr's name all of a sudden? First things first, always the guild. Dude, you're not asking me for any more missions? Oh my gosh. What does he want now? Those who appreciate beauty contribute to my next artistic... I don't know how to pronounce that. I can't speak French. Only those with a sheer eye for artistry need apply. I wait in my manner. More merchandise. I don't have enough mannequins for displaying clothes. I'm perfectly willing and capable of making my own, but gathering the materials is too much of a challenge. I've investigated where those hard-to-get materials are, so come see me if you need to know. The prelate's metal. Could I get you to indulge in somewhat of a mystery? I will be waiting in my manor and chandelier. I already picked that up while I was uncovering hexes, so... I'll go see the boutique lady first. It's too much of a hassle to leave the screen and then come back, so I'll just walk. Ooh, excuse me, my stomach rumbled. I don't know if my mic had picked up on that. I don't have any dolls yet, Daniel. Uh, the clothes in the window look really pretty. I wish Leanne had an outfit like that white dress. But she does not, sadly. What a- oh! I want to expand my shop's merchandise lines, but I don't have enough mannequins for displaying clothes. You don't have to bring me complete mannequins, though. I just want you to get the materials for making them. Will you do that for me, please? <gasps> I already have everything! Nice! Oh. oh, you found me some! Now I can show off some new merchandise, thanks so much! Um, does I've that mean... I've just all the latest for this season. Take a look! Give me more clothes, give me more clothes. <gasps> Stardust? Ooh, but no. Not until I get a cute looking skirt that matches. Mm, nah. Uh, awesome? Oh gosh, they're just cherries. I hate cherries. I'm deathly allergic. Well, not deathly, but it's annoying. 
Let's see. I found out that it's not the belt that changes, it's her holsters. Oh gosh, that's really not pretty. Oh gosh. Does she have any new A stuff? Oh, yeah, she does. Sky? Oh, it's just like jean fabric. Leaf? Ooh, more army, military style. I actually... Hmm. Wait, did I like Holiday? Nah. I either like Sky or Leaf. Let's do Sky. Yes, change. Uh, she doesn't have any new other stuff, okay. But I like her B outfit right now, so let's switch back to that. Vacheron! Grass, it's all the same. Ooh, Ivy. Not bad, but I like his plain shirt. Nude. Cardinal Barbarella produced a sexy silk men's top. Yowza. This is not nude, it is blue. And it is disgusting. Camel. Ooh, like a plain leather jacket. But I like his white and black one. What about his bee style? Japone. Ooh, that's a nice prince. Yeah. Why not? Triangle. Blinktastic Tri-Ace logo. But Zephyr already has that. Ooh, Vacheron. Yeah, see, I don't, I don't want a picture of my face on my clothes. That's weird. Huh? Printed with the phrase Cardinal Pater heard in one of his more outlandish dreams. It just as resonance of fate. Huh? Angels. Ah, uh, haha. It's the Leanne and a girl. Riddle. Nope. I don't want a creepy girl's face. Cork. No, thank you. That looks ugly. Green. I don't like him in casual clothes. Seriously, no new pants? For real? Since I just got that shirt from him, I'll leave him in his uh, B outfit. Let's see what's new for Zephyr. Uh, Faith Fossil, Memory, Lunch, Fit. Mm, don't really like that texture on a shirt. Madonna. Oh gosh, no. That looks like it'll give you a headache. Player. <laughs> He's not a player. Four. Not really feeling it. Formal. <laughs> That's funny. But I don't like the designer to pinstripes. Hex. Ooh. Now this is funky. No, I like him in this plain basic shirt. I will eventually spend money and buy all of these, but I want to save money right now. Uh, for... Ooh, brown. No, oh, thank you. I want to save money just in case I need gun customization and s other gun stuff. Can't really tell what the shirt inside shirt design is like. I guess I could look for the collar. Nah, I like what he's wearing. Switching back to his B outfit. More clothes. Gum again. Should I change Leanne into her A outfit since I got a new dress for her? But I love the separate skirts. <laughs> okay, let's head up to see Teresa. And Garigliano. Whatever he wants from me. What? Why did I run into someone? Let's just lead her salt and get the heck out of here. See, you got to see a little bit of her belly when she was whooping. This is why I like skirts. I'm a weirdo. <laughs> give me some hexes. This was not Aww. their lucky. He did not give me a hex. Shame on you, sir. You, you should have helped me. Uh, I didn't see where I had to meet Garigliano from. Was it his house? I hope it was just his house. I don't want to go into the Forest of Idols again. Exit to world map? Yes, please. I'll go see Teresa first since I already have her thing done. And it's still daytime so I can see her. 
Bye, dude. You don't need to talk to me. Hello, maid. Thank Hello, Teresa. So much. I'm glad you have all come. There's something I'd like to ask of you. It's been a long time since my man passed on, but there's still one item of his I just can't find. I would like to have it found. Hand over the item. Yes. Thank you. So oh my! Much. It really was there. It's so very odd, isn't it? Pilot Freedom first personally conferred this medal to my husband. He treated it with the utmost reverence. It makes me think that maybe he found it himself and came to tell me of its whereabouts. No, I found it for you, lady. It was near Lucia, though, so... Ah, oh, now it's nighttime. Aw, oh, man. I want to see what the rest of their house looks like. That was just the lobby. I want to see everything. Gregliano. I think him I can see any time of day, right? I don't know what time of day I can see Barbarilla. I'll have to check my mission memo. Oh, I don't want to see the, ins the rest of the inside of his house. That's just creepy. Think me beautiful? No, I don't. I think you're ugly. Ah, so it is you who have come. Very well. I foresee no problem with artists of fine distinction such as yourselves. For igniting my creative flame, I require photographs of idol statues. More precisely, I require three in all from three different sites. May I count on your help? To take quality photos, a quality camera is a must. You should use this. Accept the item. Yeah. The Rigliano's camera. So what do I have to do? Barbarella, come see me right away at my manor and chandelier. I'm in a terrible pinch and I'll simply perish if you don't hurry. Uh, blah 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 blah. So where do I go? Idol statues. Do I have to go back into the forest of idols? Oh my gosh. That would suck if I did. But that makes sense because within the forest of idol, there were three studios, open air... The one where I brought Leanne's statue, and then the la the plaster one. Ah, oh, shoot. Uh, Barbarella. Antorion! Yeah, I don't remember who he is. Barbarella. Hello, Chef Man, we meet again. I guess I could go into her house whenever I want. This lady. <laughs> This. A bottle of wine? I love this cutscene. And I haven't even finished the main course yet. And? And I want you to fetch me another bottle before I finished my meal. You're gonna be this waiting a long is time, you lady. Called? <laughs> yes. Damn you! Damn you, woman! I love his internal monologue. And yet. And yet. There's just nothing like real meat. She's so ridiculous. Oh, it doesn't get any more real than that. Oh. Asheron, you're such a perv. If you're serious about letting loose with those bunker busters, <coughs> they'll be surprised when I return fire with my trusty, trusty magnum. <laughs> no, no, have to focus. Oh Come man, it's the whites of his eyes. That's together. creepy. What did she want? Not a war. It's wine, of course. Fermented grapes. Full ripe grapes need fertile soil. Oh my gosh, I wonder what Nola North was thinking when he recorded oh, this line. It. It's so obvious. Ah, well, we have a raisins. <laughs> raisins. Oh, one wine. Coming right away. Ma'am. One wine sounds weird. He should have said one bottle. You in the bar. Take it to him, would you? You should have asked for a- ooh, sorry, hit my mic. That must have not made a good sound. Cardinal Barbarella has instructed me to give you this. Avail yourself of it if you find your way obstructed. Energy Hex. You'll need to get this- You'll need this to get to Silver Canyon. It should get you through Core Lift 2. So, your next destination, Silver Canyon, is a frozen waste. You'll want to be fully prepared before heading there. Most of the creatures there are weak to fire. These should help combat go a bit more smoothly. That's all for me. Safe travels to you. Ah, oh, shoot. So I... I wish I didn't use so many Molotov cocktails. But yeah, before she started... 
her meal, she should have checked her wine and saw that it was full. That's just stupid. You're a fool, lady. And like, if she has a- oops. I'm not supposed to be at level 1. If she has a butler, which I'm assuming she does, then he should have checked the wine and said, Hey, you should drink this. It'll go well with your meal tonight. I've been watching so much Downton Abbey, I'm like starting to know how big houses worked and ran dinners and whatnot. Also, like, how long does it take her to eat? She said she wants the wine before she finishes her meal, but I have to make it all the way down to Silver Canyon. I have to go through Silver Canyon. Uh, where was Korlov to? Was it in 5? Uh, no, it was in 6, but... Might as well go to Forest of Idols. This shouldn't take long. It shouldn't take long because I'll lead her soul and kill them all. Since, since I have to go through three stages of Forest of Idol, I'll probably cut the recording because who wants to see just battle after battle? You know what the Forest of Idols is like. There's mannequins. You don't want to see mannequin after mannequin fight. Right? I think it is Forest of Idols. Damn it! I hope you put up a better fight than the last bunch. Oh well. At least it's a leader assault. This is why I like world battles. Because then I could just go after one or two dudes instead of having to kill everyone. Like in actual full dungeon battles. I hate that. Leader assault! Sucker! Okay. Open air studio, plastic forest, bronze forest. Okay. Now I'll save the, this one. Oop. Okay, let's do this! <laughs> Hero, run! Yeah, let's see how annoying the battles are, and then see if I want to cut recording. Oh, she ran into a wall. Whoops. I like it when it gets messy. Okay. Yeah, I'll I'll probably just record when I take pictures of the idols, like when I get to the end, because I don't wanna sit through all this. I don't wanna make everyone else sit through all this, so be right back. Okay, so I was mistaken about the idol pictures. They're apparently not in the forest of idols. I wasted life and time trying to get in there. That ought to do it. This one works. I guess this works. So, Jean Palais Manor had one. And then I have to go to Lucia for another one, and then to Cranktown, where our next story mission place is headed towards. So, might as well get Lucia and then head to Cranktown. And, but before we get to Cranktown, I have to unlock a bunch of hexes! Huzzah! Do I have to walk through all of Lucia? I don't remember. Yeah, I realized it wasn't the Forest of Idols when I finished going through a whole dungeon and there was nothing at the end and I was like, What the hell? Wait, Forsaken. Does the girl saw any new stuff? Here you go. Oh, where's your- this is so vexing, what am I to do? Here you what go. are you doing? Okay, I guess she doesn't want to sell anything. Did she lose her sign? I don't see it anymore. But I can't talk to her to do anything. Hmm. Anyways, Lucia. Do I have to go to downtown again? Like oh gosh. This is gonna suck. The only good thing that came out of going through the Forest of Idols is that Leanne and Bashwan each leveled up. Dang, I need to get Leanne some better guns so that she can kill things faster. Her HP is so low. More than they could chew. I'm gonna save 
because I don't want to waste any more time than I already did. For some reason, I think I'm going to have to go through all of Lucia, so I will cut and be right back Keep your eyes again. Peeled. Oh wait, these guys are super easy. Never mind. I'll just blaze through all of this and just show everything. In the meantime, relaxing talk. Since I don't really have to go airborne. I don't know how I'm gonna get all the trophies for this game. I got them all for the PS3 version. Although, I have two different PlayStation accounts. I have a Japanese PlayStation account and I have American PlayStation account. Why do I have two? I originally made a Japanese one first because I was playing more Japanese imported games. And so I was like, might as well play these because I want to get the DLC, extras, and whatnot. But then, like, it became harder and more annoying to buy Japanese DLCs because I didn't live in Japan anymore. Like, when I made my Japanese PlayStation account, I was studying abroad in Japan. And so I was like, oh yeah, I have all this info, might as well use it. But then I haven't gone back to Japan since, so it's like, why am I still using a Japanese account? Plus a lot of Japanese games that I like don't really come out. Wait, no, that's why I do want to play them. Because a lot of Japanese games that I like don't come out in America. Like a lot of Otome games, visual novel games dating sim games, but a lot of them I can't really understand them. And so I'm like, well if they're gonna translate this game series into English anyway, might as well just stick with the English PlayStation account. Ooh. So like I got a whole bunch of tro platinum trophies on my Japanese account for like Final Fantasy 13, Catherine, if you ever played Catherine, it is a pain to get that platinum trophy because you have to play through Babel and in the English version of Catherine there was a glitch where you couldn't complete Babel at least one player mode by yourself and so I spent like three weeks trying to get platinum trophy and my fingers got blisters if you've never played Catherine don't worry I'm going to play um Catherine full body when it comes out. Although in Je in Japan it's gonna come out Valentine's Day. I don't know how much later it's gonna come out in um in Oop. Guns blazing, go kill them. Cause like the first Catherine came out like six months after the Japanese release. But I wanna play it like right away and like not have spoilers and I don't want to be missing out on Catherine. I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. My train of thought went like haywire. <laughs> oh these guys are so much easier to kill now. Oh gosh. I remember when I had so much trouble the first time I came here. Oh. Bye bye dude. But now these guys are a breeze because I'm like 18 levels higher than them. I don't wanna die, but you will, sucker! Might as well do this because scratch damage isn't gonna do jack for getting rid of the battle. Oh. Catherine is an awesome game. I can't wait to play it. I just keep looking up new info for Catherine like, oh hey, any more like gameplay videos, any more like new game mechanics. I don't want to really get spoiled on story scenes because I want to be surprised. Aw oh, man. But I see that they have a DLC that changes um, Catherine's voice, one of the Catherine's voice, to different voice actresses and I'm like, but Sawashiro Miyuki is the original Catherine. How are you going to switch her voice out? You can't. You don't. I mean, unless one of her voice options was Pakuromi, but it's not, so... Yeah, my three favorite 
Japanese voice actresses are Sawashiro Miyuki. That ought to do it. Ah, this one. Sawashiro Miyuki, uh, Pakuromi, and uh, I almost forgot her name. Tanaka Rie. I love them all. Favorite male voice actors? That voice actors? Miyano Mamugu, Midori Kawa Hikaru, and and last one. Ooh, who do I want for the last one? Kajiyuki, I think. Yeah. Like runner-ups would be Shinichiro Miki, Ko Sayuji. Mm hmm. I'm here, Corliff too. Yeah, so that's why games, if they have anything, and like, if any of the voice actors that I listed are part of that game, I will definitely get it in Japanese. Like, I remember, <laughs> before you, I even knew anything about, like, emulate- not emulating, but like, like, hacking my- not hacking, but like, I had a US PlayStation 2. Couldn't play Japanese games, but I really wanted Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories um, in Japanese because Miyano Mamoru does the voice of Riku. And I was like, ooh, I really want to play it, and I didn't think Chain of Memories would come out in America. So I read up on all this info about like, oh, here's how you can... How do I unlock this one? But they're like, here's how you can play Japanese games on a US PlayStation. And so I was like, score, this is awesome. I, I did not manage to beat Chain of Memories because I did not know enough Japanese at that time to like understand, hey, this is how the battle works, and this is the card system, and I just it was a train wreck, so I stopped playing. And then, what would you? And then, guess what happens? It came. Chain of Memories came out in America with their Kingdom Hearts 2.8 Final Mix Super Awesome Bundle package. And I'm like, why did I even try to play this in Japanese? Emulation adventures. Woo woo. Also, I want to ask if it's illegal to emulate games that you already have on a system that you own. Like, is it illegal to emulate them? Because, like, what if I had um, a Super Nintendo, but then I gave it to someone, they still haven't given it back, but I had, like, Super Mario RPG and Chrono Trigger and like other Super Nintendo games. It's okay for me to emulate it, right? Because I already paid for it once? Is that how the system works? I hope that's how the system works because I got a real hankering to play Super Mario RPG again after everyone was like, oh, Gino in Smash. Gino's not in Smash. Oh, excuse me. <coughs> oh, excuse me again. Um, I'm trying to use up all this shape hex because I farmed for it in the arena. I want to try to save other shapes because they're more rare. Although there are better ways to fit these hexes so that they're nice and neat when they come out. Um, I haven't really been getting a lot of loot from these. Okay, this one I have to use a colored. Really? I have to go like this? And then I have to go like that? That's stupid. Anyways, that's what I have to go for Barbarella. What was this terminal? Terminal that doubles flame based damage. That would be good to have. I don't think I have enough green hexes to make. 
40, though. Ooh, no, 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 no. Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I guess? No, it has to be connected. Yeah. Then I could do this. Only 14? Damn. Maybe I shouldn't have done this. Maybe this is a stupid idea. Huh? 22 out of 40. I don't know who else drops green hexes. 30 out of 40. 34 out of 40. I'm gonna run out of hexes. Ah, oh, I'm too shy. Damn it, and I didn't uncover this one. I think I could pick up more green ones in Silver Canyon, so maybe I'll just pop in and out. Uh, but in the meantime, I will do these guys. Damn it, I need a long one. Crank Town. Ooh, I do have yellow. Yes. I think, yeah, Crank Seminary is where I have to go to get my last idol photo, and Crank Town should give me more guild missions and hopefully more gun customization stuff, so... For now, I will unlock elevator to level 8. Yes, give me more things. Mm -hmm. What was I talking about? I don't even remember. It's so... it's kind of hard to think of topics of stuff to talk about when you're by yourself because you have to focus on what's happening on the screen like battle stuff you have to boom you have to keep commentating on stuff like keep saying things keep things interesting like if another person was here I could just like bounce off of them or like they could keep up the combo but I'm all by myself. So, I hope this is fun to watch. I might as well use this. And then... Oh no, there was a thinger! I am a fool. I should have used this one. I don't want to get rid of the yellow around Crank Summoner, just in case. Purple eyes for Zephyr? Cool. Where's the other purple eye? There you go. Orients. I heard somewhere that it's like not PC to use the word Orient anymore. Like it's racist. And I'm like, why? Doesn't Orients just mean from the east? But I guess there's something bad about using it. I don't know. Uh, let's go further down. Oh man, can I go to that narrow section? I do not want to use my long straight ones if I can avoid it. Nah, it looks like I'll have to use it. These guys are gold, man. Rasipeed! What do you do? Frost resistance. Ooh, a terminal that reduces ice page damage. That would be cool if I can link it all the way up to Silver Canyon, but I don't have the proper hexes to do so. So I won't. This one must be a this thinger. Mm -hmm. Oh, and then maybe I'll get a reward for unlocking all the hexes on this level. Although, I think there might be another way to get down to level 7. Sometimes they trick you. They split up the area. Okay, this one, let's use this one. Because I can farm that one in Arena too, I just didn't spend the time or effort. Crank 10. Boom. Ooh, two things. It's weird that they say level 7 is too cold, and that's where all the frosty things are, but I'm like, level 1, Basil's Repairman, ooh, I unlocked half of uh, Basil's hexes. Uh, that should be it, right? That should be... No, I'm missing one. Ah, oh, damn it. 
Ooh, I want us to get him to chit chat more. I'm not much for backing down from a fight. Me neither. Um, how does this one work again? Fight me! But yeah, the, it, the altitude of the levels of level 1 and 2 where the cardinals live is way higher than this place. So shouldn't that place be more freezing? Like, why is this one particularly snowy? It doesn't make sense. Like, where my base is, level 4, it's higher than level 7. Let's not let this go to our head. <gasps> Another green one! It's nighttime. Green one. Boom. Yes, terminal activated. Energy stations of Reckon on the floor can be used to travel back to base instantly. Oh, maybe I should I don't have a green station hex though, so. Boop boop. Hello? You're cute. Naomi, the bartender knows more about makeup than I do, and I'm a woman. So people kinda it? have knowledge about more things than other people. Quit your staring already. What, you have a thing for this sort of outfit? Rude. Did you need Oh, yoo-hoo! What if I talk to you as Vacheron? Yeah. What if I talk to you as Leanne? Huh. He likes everyone. Exit to world map. Yes, sir. Okay, um... Before I head on to Silver Canyon, I want to go to Crank Town? I want to look at the store and whatnot. Um, hotel, can I go into here? Is this the guild? No, it's an actual inn. I saw a sparkly though. What have we here? Glass shard, lovely. I don't think I should rest at the inn. I don't think I'm hurt anyway. Um, ah, this place is super freaking depressing. I think this was the guild. Yeah, this was. New missions. I need someone to lay down energy hexes on level 9 and make a path to the mine entrance. That's all I want done. Ooh, do I have enough hexes left? How do I get down to level 9? Oh, yeah, it's a merchant girl. I've waited so long for my revenge. I finally found them. Hunters who avail themselves of my services are to report to me immediately. I'll be waiting in Forsaken. Ooh, so should I go back to her? Hmm, yeah, I should. Because I do want to record going through all story missions, even if I don't do, like, fighting hey stuff. There. I may not make quite as much as you all, but I'm doing pretty darn well for myself. Good for you. you got it. I'll take it apart. Scrapper! Did you see what a cargo walker carries on his back? I bet that cargo can be dismantled to get a ton of materials. Uh, I don't want to scrap anything yet. This is just a humble country Stock store. up on cure kits. Not it's good for offer. instantly healing status illness like immolation, freezing, electrocution, and poison. Do you have any... I, nope. Custom kit set. You have the same thing as the other dude. The yeah, are good dangerous for now. By night. Be careful. I've got Work customization. Yes, I do want an ice resistant vest. Cold padding. Uh, Because I'm gonna go into... Oh, I only have one lumber though. Damn it. I don't think anyone really gets poison ice resistant vest. But where do I get lumber? Finished anyway? already? I will equip the ice thing on Leanne because she has the machine gun. And she has the I'm Hello? sick to death of this. Outsiders aren't welcome around these parts, especially the likes of you. I'm sorry, you're rude. Um Wait, who are you? Level 4? Cafe Chelsea, I have to go all the way back up there? And I have to go to Forsaken? Oh gosh. Let me go to Cranktown first then, because it's right here anyway. Then I could stop up by Garigliano. Damn it! You better drop some lumber. Looks like there's only one leader. Deities. Oh man, they have different skills when they use guns, cause like if Zephyr has the machine gun equipped, one of his skills when he charges up is full scratch damage. 
Rianne doesn't have that, she has something totally different. Oh, why are you so strong? Oh, they're level 20, I didn't realize. I thought they'd still be in the teens. Whoopsies. I should have charged up more with Leanne. Rob from the weak. That's no Again, Rob from the rich man. My house. Done. Dead. Bye. If you're gonna point a gun at someone, make uh, sure you know nope. who you deal No lumber. Thanks, seminary. Hello. This area is under Cardinal Lagerfeld's authority. Even among his esteemed colleagues, Cardinal Lagerfeld pieties stand out. He also values law and order. I don't know who Lagerfeld is. He doesn't have a mansion in level 1 or 2, so... Hmm. Does this place look familiar? Malevolent idol. That never sounds good. This music's creepy too. Kinda reminds me of Shadow of the Colossus. I love Shadow of the Colossus. I've been playing through the PS3 version with my friends because I want to show them what Shadow of the Colossus is like because it's freaking amazing and everyone should play that game at least once in their life. Yeah, she has stun rate as one of her things. I don't think Zephyr has that. I've been wondering if I should play the PS4 version of Shadow of the Colossus on my channel though. Should I, should I, should I? Should I not? I have so many games I want to play though. So many games, so little time. But games I'm definitely going to play after I finish Resonance of Fate on my channel are... Um, Kingdom Hearts 3, just because I want to record my reactions because of how freaking ridiculous Kingdom Hearts got. It's just too many characters, too many side stories. Like, Sora's split up into how many parts now? Five, six versions of him? It's freaking redonk. Oh no, I should have gone to Forsaken. Forsaken, see the girl. Level 4, Cafe Chelsea. Here you go. Hi. Some time ago, I was chased around this level by some hard machines. In the confusion, I somehow lost my billboard. A merchant is simply lost without one. After a lot of hard work, I finally managed to find it, sitting on top of some tinny machine's head. It's posing as a merchant with my billboard. Please, get back my billboard! Where's the monster, though? Which level is it at? Is it in a red hex? Is it in a dungeon? Oh... I'm guessing it's one of those that popped them. Don't really want to show battles yet. I want to complete Garigliano's thing first. Level 4! Really? One charge couldn't take him out? Another thing I don't really get about this game, like there's different party parts that you can attack on dudes. I could make this shot with my eyes. And it's like, hey, I'm going for the head, I should jump and get on top of them. That doesn't always destroy their head parts, so I'm like, how do I aim then? How do I know which body part I'm aiming at to get items from that part? I don't know. And then sometimes, like, scratch damage, I only have to charge up once and then, like, it's all full sometimes. I have to charge huh. up five times. The entrance to the Dakota Vein is on level 9. Make me a path to it using energy hexes. Come see me when you finish the path to Dakota Vein. You'll get your payment then. How do I get to level 9 though? I've only just reached 7. Was there an elevator to 9 on level 7? Seriously? Seriously? You have gotta do this to me. Oh well, at least it's a human enemy, so he'll drop hexes. Why not? I should give Zephyr back his machine gun, but I kind of want to have Leanne use the machine gun a bit longer. Garigliano! Lots of traveling back and forth. Ooh, Zephyr's butt. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, Oops, sorry. Wasn't paying attention. Something popped up on my computer screen. Do -ba -do -ba -do. Uh, man, just give me a dark purple so I can get rid of that one hex. It's so freaking annoying. 
I think Garigliano, I could go in whether it's day or night. He doesn't seem to mind. Come on, I completed it. Give me stuff. And over there, sublime, despairing, malevolent. Do you think me ah, you're back. I've been waiting. You've got my photos then. I'll take the camera back so I can get on with developing the film. Post haste. I got an ice resistant vest. Nice. Just in time. Uh, I'll give it to Vacheron. He has a flame resistant and ice resistant. Okay, and now, what did I have to do? I have to do Barbarella's main mission. Yeah, uh, him and her. Okay, well, I think this is it for this episode. Uh, next time I will show me fighting to get the signboard back and unlocking hexes for Dakota Vane. I don't think I'm allowed to go there yet though, I think it might be too high level, but whatever, next time I'll just be right there. So anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time, stay toasty!